Uh, this screen behind me that I was planning on using uh, for a video, I'm going to do in a couple of days with a couple friends of mine. Apparently, um, I can also color key that. Uh, I wasn't thinking that I was going to be able to um, color key it uh, because normally the chroma key is reserved for... Um, yeah, let's do this here. Excuse you. You're in my face. Get out. Sorry. Alright, um, sorry about that. Uh, as you can see, I have altered my setup. Uh, if you've been following me for a while, then you know when I had uh, my previous title and I was working out with a different group of people that I uh, have used a setup before. Um, so it might be familiar to some of you uh, if you've watched any of my older videos, which um, don't, please don't. They were so bad. Um, so yeah, so as you can see, um, I am Dr. Double Rainbow. It's moving. It's moving away from my finger. Okay, Dr. Double Rainbow. Um, and you can find me on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, or uh, Facebook, Facebook, YouTube, Twitch, Twitter. There we go. I got it right. Um, so yeah, so I got all my icons at the bottom, got my name uh, and watermark here, uh, got this nice thing. Uh, this is normally for when I'm streaming uh, and I have that this idle page so it can say, you know, I might be checking out, uh, checking my equipment or getting some food, stuff like that. Um, so you're probably not going to see this a whole lot on my YouTube. I just wanted to show my new setup around everybody who hasn't uh, seen it yet. Today we're going to be continuing in uh, my Sao series, SAO, Sword Art Online, Lost Song. Um, Right now, I believe we left off. Uh, if you missed the live stream, that's unfortunate. I had a friend, um, LITD Sandman. You can find him on YouTube and on Twitch. And he was up here helping me out some commentary uh, about the world of ALO. So I'm going to share a couple of things that uh, people might have missed in this video. But um, I'm not going to be posting any of my live streams or any events or anything on YouTube. So if you miss them and they're not like on my Twitch archive, I'm sorry. Um, Please tune in. Uh, follow me on Twitter if you want, or follow me on Twitch. It'll let you know when I go live. You don't have to subscribe, although I would appreciate uh, any support you guys decide to give. So, um, anyway, back to the game. Sort of online. I think we're about to do a side quest. We got to help some people. Um, some guy went into the area that we just cleared in the pre in the first quest that had all the boss and all that in there. Um, some guy went in there and got stuck so we're going to go help him I want to say that's what we're about to do um, let me try to actually turn the game on um, and as you can see uh, over here um, sometimes I do like to listen to music uh, my earbud here um, unfortunately I share that on the stream uh, it's actually the audio is going on the stream through some other feature but I can't upload that on YouTube because some of the music is already copyrighted. So if you want to listen along with me uh, while I'm doing the video, in case you know I, you, I randomly start singing or stuff like that or humming, and you're like, what the hell is he humming? Um, I'm probably going to, I don't know if I'm going to leave that up during a video, but I'm definitely going to have that up there during my idle sessions um, so that you guys can see. Right now I'm listening to Reverie by uh, Michael St. Laurent. Um, I do want to post a uh, link on the bottom of this video uh, to the playlist. It's actually um, by someone that I followed on Spotify. Uh, I can't quite remember his name right now. Some Kent something. Uh, this is his Chill Step playlist. Um, I do I like listening to, to Chill Step to like vocal dubstep to uh, if you've heard Glitch Hop, any of the Glitch Hop playlists, the top Glitch Hop of this year or whatever. Uh, I am a fan of listening to that, so um, I'm uh, playing some of that. It's basically video game music, just slightly remixed and a little bit cooler with some vocals. So I play that in the background, um, and yeah. So all that said, um, I am actually joining uh, Multi Dragon Gamers. You may remember a another live stream that I did if you've already uh, seen that, and I think uh, the person who I was with has that on his channel. Um, he made the Multi Dragon Gamers group. It's a group of people that I know. We're all friends. Um, so I'm joining his channel. We're all going to be streaming together. We're going to have a new. This is our goal. We're going to have a new video every six hours uploaded to YouTube. Um, 
we want to try and get live streams uh, of either just us doing a binge playlist or um, maybe playing some multiplayer so you guys can jump into that, us all playing a game together, something like that. We want to try and get an event at least one or two times a week, uh, hopefully up closer to two or three times a week. And um, we're going to try and do uh, some giveaways. I know I have um, people that watch uh, anime and um, Korean drama and all that stuff. I have uh, some Crunchyroll Premium. Um, like I think it's like 48 or 72 hour uh, passes and stuff that I've uh, accumulated. I do want to go ahead and give those out. Um, so I'm going to try and do a giveaway uh, next week. All this is going to start on Monday. Um, I'm going to post this to my channel uh, over this weekend, and then I'm going to post uh, the same video is going to be up on Monday. So if you're watching this on Monday, that stuff is going to be starting the whole rest of this week. Um, I know that he's, I think he wants to play uh, his Fallout 4 series. I'm not sure which one of us is, is going to do that, but I'm definitely going to be um, finishing my Sal series, a couple of the other games uh, that I mentioned in a previous video, which had horrible sound. So if you didn't want to watch that, um... I'm going to be playing uh, some Final Fantasy, Shadow of Mordor, uh, New Assassin's Creed, um, and a couple other games, uh, some indie titles and stuff like that that I like to play. Um, and I'm also going to be showing off, since I do have uh, my gaming PC back up and running, I'm going to be showing off some um, some modding and stuff, uh, some, maybe some GTA mods, definitely some Fallout 4 mods when those come out, um, how the uh, console works, all that kind of stuff. I do like to play... Um, play on PC a lot more than on consoles because consoles are shit so not gonna be doing that well I'd say that this game is shit this game's not shit yeah so um Anyway, anyone who uh, is a real console junkie who loves playing on PS4, Xbox One, uh, I'm not liking the experience. Um, it is really cool how they've gotten gone up from the previous to PS3, Xbox 360, all the way up to the PS4 and Xbox One, how all the things they've changed. But all the stuff that they've added, that they've been bragging about, that everyone's all hype about, has been on gaming PCs for years and years and years. And the PS4s, the PS4, Xbox One, they came out and they were already outdated. And it's, uh, it is what it is. Um, if you like the community, PS4, definitely I do. That's one plus. Um, I can hop, hop up here, find my friends really easily, play a lot of multiplayer games, stuff like that. So I am going to be, uh, doing, um, playing my, a lot of my own multiplayer in my free time, like, uh, the new Call of Duty. I'm not really a Call of Duty fan, but um, the new Black Ops 3 looks really interesting. Definitely going to be playing Star Wars. Like, my every time that I'm not on stream, I'm probably going to be on there. Um, and Destiny, I do like to play those. And ESO, I do have that on um, PS4. I'm going to get it on PC uh, real soon. So, anyway, um, if I'm going to put a link uh, on the bottom of this so anyone who doesn't want to hear me blabber on and on about all the new stuff that I'm really excited about, you can just skip straight to the action. I'm going to make sure that I include um, at least, like I said, I'm going to try and make these videos at least 30 to 35 minutes of full-on content. That's like not me talking, not me pausing, not me going to the bathroom, just gameplay, gameplay, gameplay. Um, and I'm going to try not to do any more uh, breaks or anything. If... I'm about to start. Um, I don't. I don't. Wanna, I don't want to say that yet. I'm not gonna jinx that. Um, so anyway, uh, if you if I do actually end up uh, pausing or anything uh, to go to the bathroom, I'll try and make sure that I cut that out of uh, the YouTube video if possible. Um, for people on stream, normally when that happens, you're either gonna see this screen and obviously a white background, or uh, probably gonna throw a ad in there. Um, and people on YouTube, it's probably going to be an ad there too, because ads are life. Um, unless you're on YouTube Red, then there's no ads, and we still get support. Anyway, um, <laughs> so enough of me talking bullshit. Uh, let me start up Sal right quick, and we can go ahead and get to the game.
This is actually kind of loud. Alright, so I'm going to turn the, the game a little bit down here. Uh, oh god, it's really loud in my ear, too. That's crazy. Alright, let's see if I can't get this color filter shit to work for me. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. Uh, it's okay over here to me. Um, so people in the stream that are watching this, uh, if I'm blocking anything, please let me know. Um, obviously, the uh, people that are watching this on YouTube aren't going to be able to tell me that. So if you guys go ahead and hit me with the heads up, that would be awesome. And I'm going to go ahead and I get started here. Uh, downside to this, I can't have uh, my second camera um, to where uh, that I've been having, where you can see like both sides, like me looking at the TV and all that. So I just sort of removed my stuff over here. So, uh, I see on my face, it's like weird, there's an outline of white around me, but it's not really, it's negligible almost. I just need to get a, a green background and just do that. That would be so much easier, wouldn't it guys? Wouldn't it? Yeah, sorry. Also, sorry if this mic is not really loud, I can't quite tell how loud it is, but it doesn't seem to be that loud to me, so. Hoping it's not way louder than the video. I'm also hoping that the video is not way louder than me, because that would be the opposite of the point. Okay, so, um, yeah, last we left off, I believe uh, we, re we talked to these people, and their friend is trapped in a cavern. So, let's go see what the fuck is up with that. Okay, I've got Silica and Philia with me. I'm not sure what the hell they're wearing. That's their normal clothes, really? Are you sure? You say so. It must have been like or something. I don't know. Yeah, so anyway, um people that are just now tuning into this, um turn this up a little bit. Yeah. So um people that are just now tuning in, uh just now again to um, see the stuff that is all about. Uh, how unfortunate. I wish you would have seen all the videos. Because then you wouldn't be lost. Um, so, yeah, so we came into this cavern here and we cleared out the area um, of all the monsters and we defeated the boss. So, I guess now there's a couple of monsters that are a little bit different from what we fought that respawned into uh, this area. The door that we opened is still already open. The fuck? Okay. Alright, so he just wants to go help him. That works. We can do that. Okay, so um, these guys are really weak.
sorry, just switching this around after I had a new skill. Okay, so. It's kind of tedious. Curious as to how he got stuck in like I see that there's a lot of bats and they're kind of annoying to fight. But it's not really the boss isn't here. He didn't fight that guy. He was here. The thing I do like about this is because you have the weak and strong attacks uh, that you can do combos, but Kyrtos can also be uh, one sort of fairly short. So I guess you have to rely on the uh, original sword skills to do stuff. But then sometimes your skills just completely freaking miss like that. And then you just. Yeah. Uh, yeah. The fact that you can't fly in caves makes it really annoying to fight flying enemies. Oh god. So, I guess it's fair if you're not kind It's not like in the previous game where you, if there were someone who was like such a high level, that their evasion was so high that you actually couldn't hit them. Like, every attack would miss. So if you got caught off guard by a high level enemy, there was just nothing you could do up there. So I like that they changed that to make this a little bit less ridiculous. But, it's still I guess both of them use daggers, so they have to be like really, really close in their enemies to do damage. Which makes this fight here not very really useful for them. Okay, so my dart attack does do a fair bit of damage, because he had a lot of health. So, where's the guy that we're supposed to be using? No, I don't think you got any stronger. Okay. I really saved your bacon. I did save your bacon. Your bacon is totally secure. Thanks only to me. My big and saving skills. I just want to just get into here. Alright, um, another thing uh, that I think I only addressed on stream um, was the crafting system in this game. I don't think there actually is one. As far as I've seen, um, you can buy and sell uh, items, equipment, and weapons as usual. You can upgrade weapons that you found. Um, the, one of the major differences is that any weapons that you find out in the field, you actually do have to get, um, appraised if they're not, um, already, like, something that's labeled, so you can't just pick up a weapon out on the ground and go, huh, I'm just, I'm just gonna use this now. Um, so, that makes it a little bit more like the original game. 
but yeah, I'm not sure uh, how crafting is gonna work uh, in this. I haven't seen anything about it yet, so but just be on the lookout for it. <sighs> Sorry, I'm yawning so much. Yes, I know that I'm amazing. Two healing tinctures and two mana potions. Okay. Is that it? Alright. I'm not sure what to do next. I guess. Okay. I think that we should go to that place where the, all the quests are, and then pick up some quests. Ooh, complete. Son of a bitch. Alright, we'll just pick up all the quests. I do. I uh, had some iron sand on me, so let's turn that in. We can move on. Okay, so let's pick a quest. So this is basically just go out and kill everything in that whole area a lot and then you'll get your complete quest. So Yeah, I don't want to Give anything and cut any uh, footage out, uh, even if it does end up getting a little bit grindy because I don't want to miss anything important on an accident. Um, so I think I'm just gonna go. やっぱりセブンちゃんすげえよな。こんなにいい歌を何曲も作り続けながら、MIT を出。しかもあの可愛さったら尋常じゃないわよ。はい、やめておけよ。お前はセブンちゃんを、あいつはゴヤ隊み
multiple world tours. She's currently holding concerts in ALL. So I'm assuming that she's either having a concert right now or she's going to a concert, she's outside, something like that. But all these people are really like her and her guild Shamrock is one of the strongest guilds um, in ALO right now. I'm not sure why because I feel she doesn't really peg me as the kind of person who would just power level in an MMO to try to get really strong. So I'm assuming that she just has a bunch of strong people in her guild because she doesn't like weaklings. No, it's her preference. Is that her? Okay, so that's seven. The girl. Um, that's interesting. Maybe she's not a puka. Okay, so she is a puka? What the hell is a puka? I feel like I'm missing something fundamental from like ALO is like that show. Um, if anybody knows what's going on, just please let me know. Because I'm lost in that show. Okay, so Kirito's talking about the blue haired guy, man next to seven. Wow. They really didn't care about names in this. <laughs> hey, Klein. Hey, black guy. What's that? No, no. Seven Please stop. How did everybody just show up right now? Okay, so Shamrock the Guild are the only people that Seven likes out of all her fans that are in ALO. Okay, that's fair point. So everybody in Shamrock is actually strong because Kirito follows them. And apparently Seven is really weak. シャムロック。あの子は自分で戦わずに周囲に戦わせてギルドとしても戦績は自分で戦わずにそういう風に攻略していくスタイルもあるのね。クエストランキング上位 Is it that guy? Is he the number one player? Hey, it's Eugene. Maybe by the way, you guys can see these if you're actually reading them. Stray, stop being such a hole. Even though you're not a real person. Wait, so Yuji lost the blue haired guy? Uh, Sumeragi, that's man next to Seven's name. Who the fuck? What? Nice hair, random character who has no name. Although, to be totally fair, not having a name is apparently not strange in this game. Because no one has a fucking name. See? I talked to one random person, which is great, because there's lots of people, and I like being able to talk to a lot of people. But none of them have names, and none of them say anything important. And they walk like this. Do you see this shit? What the fuck are you doing? Stop. Stop. Thank you. And you're just sprinting. Uh, hello? 
we'll go with the is that recon? Oh my god, no. Okay. People that have seen ALO know this guy. He is Creeper who is obsessed with Leafa in I guess in the real world and he followed her into this game and he sucks shit. You are not a friend of Leafa's. Oh, here we go. What proof, Recon? What proof? When we're in town, we stand next to each other? What does that mean? We're close to each other physically in... Okay. Okay, that's a little bit more substantial. Yes, Rika. Some people that don't suck get asked to do things. That's the real question. Why the hell are you spying on us? That's the subject! I'm not changing the subject! That's the subject that you brought up! You said... That. And I responded to your subject. You have an ace up your sleeve? What? What is the ace? What are you even talking about? No. I don't remember doing that. Okay, maybe we did do that, and I just have really shitty memory. Okay. Yeah, that's what you do. You play together in the game. That's the whole point of the game. You saw us playing the game? We were holding hands. What are you, four? What the fuck? See, even Kirito doesn't know what the fuck you're talking about. You held hands so often, it's not a big deal with you anymore? Listen to you. Look, 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 let me tell you something. I have probably held hands with literally every female character in the entire game. Every one of them. Every one who has ever been a female in the whole, like, all of Sal. Like, out of the 6,000 people in Sal that didn't die, like, 2,000 of them were probably female, and I probably held all of their hands. So it's really, you're not, <laughs> like, I don't think you understand. I don't, I don't, how did you arrive at that conclusion? He's shaking. That's... <laughs> you're just like, ah, I remember now. You're fucking retarded and kind of freaking me out. She trusts me? Well, according to the continuity of this game, she was in Sao, which means that I basically saved all of their lives, like, by myself. So, I'm sure that they probably all trust me. Yeah, she probably doesn't look at you like that because you look like that. You're in a game where you can choose the way your avatar looks, and you chose physically to look that fucking stupid. <laughs> I don't need your pity. You do. You really do. You need someone's pity. Wow, you yourself down, kid. What the fuck are you even talking about? 
<laughs> Technically, we're, we're gonna go with that. We're gonna go with the, the little sister for now. Yes, Rika. Yes. Yes. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, he's gonna explode. <laughs> he's gonna die. No, don't, don't. Eh? <laughs> no. How? How did it not occur to you? My avatar physically looks like she does in the real world. Technically, you can. Because you can't die in this game. No, please stop. Please go away. Yeah. Sure. You could say that. You could also say that I follow her around on a regular basis. But that would be equally not wrong. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> How? How did you get that? Because he's a professional stalker, he must be her boyfriend. No. No. No, you won't. I'll kill you. Oh, God, no. Do I have to deal with him the whole rest of the game? I wish this was Sal so I could just take him into a boss fight and then just stand in the back of the room and wait till he gets killed so I don't have to deal with him anymore. I mean, no, that's kind of rude. But oh, hell no. No, <laughs> oh thank God. <laughs> Leafa, thank you. I'm not sure what what temperature is it? Cause you're wearing boots, knee high socks, and like spats. Like, there's, like, one, like, millimeter of, like, skin on your leg that's exposed to the air. You would think that if they put all five senses in this game, that you would overheat and die from that ridiculous outfit. I obviously didn't hit you hard enough. Yes. I can't. I can't believe that he stalks you because I think that's the only thing that he actually said. No. Yeah, you're not supposed to call people by their real names. It's not safe. You should have learned that in GGO. Where your friend, well, you no, know, that was the Sino. Where Sino's friend snuck into her house and tried to rape her while she was in her nerve gear. <laughs> I had to walk all the way over here for that. Oh, God. Is there. No, I have a message. Mr. Brother, sir, I don't want to. You and Leaf are so awesome. Don't worry, I'll always have your backs. There's no way that you can even catch up to my back. By the time you reach level 100, I will be level 473. And there's nothing you can do about it. I, don't, I also don't like how they removed your friends list from this game. So you can't actually see everyone that you've already met before and all that like you can in the previous game. They took a lot of the actual RPG MMO elements out of that out of this game that were in the previous game. And I don't really know why, because there's not any point in not having those. Because this is supposed to be about an MMO okay. Oh, hell no. Okay, I don't want you guys in my party. Oh, fuck do I get back in the circle? Let's listen to these people talk. Okay, yeah. I gotta switch these people out. I mean... 
In this game, they started us all off uh, around the same level, so... Taking anyone out anywhere isn't that big of a concern, especially since you can't, like, there's no permadeath. In the previous game, if you, like, if I wanted to go take Silica somewhere, I had to take her to, like, the lowest possible floor that we could get to, so that I could, like, level her up to the point where, um, she wouldn't die if we went into battle, because if I took her out, um, regularly, she would just fucking die. The fuck? Okay. I don't think, uh, we met, um, Argo, uh, on video. I think that was probably on stream. So, um, people that don't know, Argo was in Sao. Um, she was a information broker. Um, and she helped Kirito get a bunch of information about, um, rare items and weapons and stuff. Um, while they were all going through the game. She was also in the previous game. And I guess now she's in ALO, which is pretty cool. But, um,. I'm not sure that I want to take her out to fight, because she's not... Hey, fighting type. I guess I haven't really taken Leaf out there, so I'll take her out Leaf out. And we'll go... And... Do, um... Actually, you know what? I think I'm not actually uh, gonna end this this video over right here. Um, since we're already at the uh, 45 minute mark. Um, so, ah, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> all right. Uh, thank you everybody for watching. I um, hope you like my new setup. If you have any suggestions for how I can improve it or uh, make some changes. Um, other than getting a green screen, because I've already had like four people tell me that. Um, I know that I don't have a green screen, but uh, I'm gonna work on that. Uh, I don't even know. I don't even know if I give a shit. So anyway, um, like I said, uh, a couple of the other new things we're planning on doing. Um, we're gonna have new video uh, every six hours on the new channel. Um, my videos are gonna be primarily uh, in our 10 a.m. slot. Um, so obviously we're gonna be, we're gonna be posting a 10 and 4, both 10s, both 4s. Um, so that way that people that are watch, like to watch stuff in the morning have something to watch, people that like to watch stuff, uh, when they get off of work, or before they go to work, if they work at night, have something to watch, um, and vice versa. So, um, people that get off around 10 o'clock at night have something to watch, people that get up at 10 o'clock in the morning, people that get up at 4 o'clock, people that get off at 4, people that get up at 4 and get off at... Or, uh, yeah, that's the confusing thing about time. So, um, anyway, so we're going to be doing that. Uh, we're definitely going to be doing um, some more live streams, some more events. Um, I'm going to be doing some more giveaways. I'm actually, uh, I think I might start, um, this might not be this week coming up, this Monday uh, through Friday that we're going to do this. Um, but I think that I'm gonna do um, my own series because uh, I'm also um, other than playing games uh, I'm a programmer um, I'm also a uh, hobbyist composer so I might do um, a little bit uh, videos on doing playing some music um, doing some stuff like that or maybe um, I might pick a project uh, one of my projects that I'm working on currently um, that I can actually show you guys because the previous one I just finished I'm not allowed to tell anyone about um, but I'll do a video where I show off um, some of that maybe and um, I'm trying to think of what else uh, was that we agreed to do I know I came up with some ideas um, <laughs> that I gave uh, to I guess uh, his name is going to be uh, show me a noob um, so you can find Show Me a Noob on YouTube or Twitch. Um, 
me, Dr. Double Rainbow. You can find me here. Um, you might also be able to find me if you can't look me up by that name. You can look me up by my uh, old name, Shadow Fiend X. Um, that's E I, not I E, because I E is taken a lot. Um, and uh, L I T D Sandman. Um, also, be on the lookout for Keenan Brogen. Um, he is, I've been talking to him. He said he's going to be coming back to the whole streaming recording scene. I'm not sure if he's going to join us over here at Multi Dragon Gamers, but um, by the time of me recording this, I don't know. But I mean, by Monday, he might have already said something about it. Um, so yeah, a new video every six hours. Um, we're going to be doing a couple videos like this where it's uh, like an interactive um, thing on the stream What I'm actually going to record and put up here so we can tell you about all the new stuff that we're going to be doing, um, all the games we're going to be streaming. Uh, we want to do that every um, couple of videos so that uh, people that are actually watching all of the content, uh, thank you for showing massive support and watching you know, four videos a day. Um, so that those people know what new things are going to be coming out um, and we're going to be trying to do um, every nine days let me let me swap this out so you can actually see my fingers we're not gonna we're not gonna pretend like you didn't know what the fuck I was doing there alright every nine days um, we're gonna start a new series or a new type of video so um, at the end of a nine day time period my um, that's not to say that all our streams are going to only, like, all our video series are only going to last nine days. Like, my Sal video series, the way that it's looking <sighs> will probably end up being, um, two, maybe three weeks, um, if I spread out, uh, the videos and stuff that I'm going to do. Um, but every nine days, new videos, um new types of stuff so I might pick up uh, pick up a different game um, and start recording and showing some of that but I'm still gonna be doing all my sound stuff so that we can add more and more content reach more people that like to watch more games without compromising the people that like to watch the games we already have um, so I want to be able to do that and um, at least once in all those uh, nine day periods I want to be able to do some sort of uh, live stream uh, group session giveaway type thing um, so that's definitely going to be something that I'm looking forward to. And, um, last but not least, every month, um, I'm not going to say, I'm not going to go as far as say every month is going to get a name because that's, it's a lot of naming. Uh, but every month, uh, is going to get a theme. We're going to have to, we're going to do an event. Hopefully, um, either all four of us are going to do a theme video, um, together, or each of us is going to do, um, uh, you know, part. It's all gonna be one theme. The whole channel is gonna have one theme, but we might do videos together. It might be two of us doing the video together, three of us, all of us, whatever. Um, so that's all cool stuff to look forward to. Um, I'm gonna put all of this information uh, on the channel, all about um, whatever we're gonna be doing. I'm gonna try and do another actual just PSA video by itself, where I'm talking about all this for people that aren't watching this shit now. Uh, this is mostly for people that are watching on the stream. Um, and I'm going to try to separate after uh, we actually do join up. After the first week, I'm going to separate my streaming and my videoing. So this is going to be the last time, um, the last week where I'm going to be doing a stream and then cutting up parts of the stream uh, and releasing the videos on YouTube. Or just going to be either doing a straight stream um, or a straight YouTube video. The whole stream, obviously... Um, <sighs> Since I don't know how we're going to have our uh, Twitch and everything set up, our streams will definitely uh, be broadcast. We'll definitely tell everybody about them, but they might not be saved. So if you miss the event, you may have just missed the event, and you'll have to wait until the next time we do anything um, to join in. But, um... Hmm. I'm trying to think. Um... Oh, one more thing. Um, I did mention uh, previously that in for my YouTube videos, I'm going to be recording that I wouldn't do um, shooters because I didn't. Uh, I don't want to look really fucking dumb doing shooters in YouTube videos. Um, that having been said, since this is going to be the last week where I'm doing streaming in YouTube um, together, I am going to be doing at least 
I'm gonna go. I'm gonna. I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw two out there. I'm gonna do at least two. Bat, um, Star Wars Battlefront streams. Those may end up as YouTube videos. Don't take that as me going um, against my word saying that I wasn't gonna be posting a lot of shooter content. Um, that's just because a Star Wars is fantastic, and people that don't like Star Wars, I don't understand. I mean, you may not have liked the original Star Wars movies. Okay, I get that, but like this this game. I, I was in the beta, so I haven't even played the game game that has already come out. But in the beta, it was fantastic. It was one of the biggest betas um, of all time. I'm not sure if it, I don't I think it ended up being the biggest, but it was a really huge thing. Um, me and my brother were in the beta, and um, a friend of mine, uh, we were all playing together. And it was great. And I didn't actually have, uh, I wasn't able to pre-order the game, and so I didn't have a chance to get it and to play it until recently so my streams I'm gonna be doing uh, over I'm do over the weekend that I normally do which is normally a shooting a shooter game just so I can like wind down from all the RPG and all that shit that I've been doing the whole week um, I don't know if I'm gonna have that on YouTube uh, but I'm definitely gonna be doing at least one or two other streams during the week uh, of a shooter which is not something that I normally do so people that are on my uh, channel right now look forward to that or avoid it if you don't like watching shooters I'm gonna go ahead and uh, give you the heads up on the date so you know just you don't have to tune in I'm not gonna grab force you guys who don't like to watch shooters since I'm normally an RPG open world type guy anyway but gotta blow off some seams sometime uh, and I think this is a happy medium between um, the Battlefield games that DICE has been doing and um, the actual Star Wars series itself, um, which I'm a huge fan of. Um, I know another exception that I made was Destiny. I was also in the Destiny beta. When I played Destiny, it was more had a lot more RPG elements than um, shooter type things. It was really it was open. It's really open. You can do whatever you want. Um, so. I don't know if I'm going to be doing any of those videos either. That's something that I'm actually not including in the shooter category um, at all. It's sort of like um, <sighs> Borderlands. I don't include Borderlands uh, as a FPS um, category, even though it is technically a first-person shooter because of all the RPG elements. So I'll make sure that I'll uh, tell everybody and all that stuff in advance, you know, what I'm going to be doing. So if you want to watch... That's the whole point of us having four videos every day. Um, every, you can tune in every day, and if there's somebody playing a shooter and you hate shooters, and there's somebody playing a MOBA and you hate MOBAs, and there's someone playing an open world game, you hate open world games, and someone playing a strategy game and you hate strategy games, you can watch any of the other videos. If you hate all of those, why are you watching me? Stay frosty, guys. Uh, I'll be back to you uh, momentarily if you're on the stream. If you're watching this YouTube video, be sure to check out the next video on the South series, which we're going to be going out, uh, figuring out how to get to that floating island that uh, I mentioned with the door and possibly doing another one of the side quests. So uh, thank you guys for tuning in, and I'll catch you guys.